welcome back to the channel guys another video here about how much this project cost the client and what the time actually took so another time and cost video i appreciate you tuning in we're gonna get into it this project was done in the summer of 2023 here we go I like to mention before the video starts is this is why I charge a client at this time at this time of the year with the market was doing prices are going to vary greatly depending on how busy I am how the market's doing how everything's doing as you know the cost of materials have gone way up so I have to lease charge for the materials my labor kind of goes up and down again according to the market at the time hope you enjoy the video Okay, if you just want to know how much and how long, skip to the end of the video. I'm going to go through each clip here, showing what I did approximately each day or so. I'm going to explain. So this was the second day in the project. The first day, I prepped the whole site, protected everything, the floors and whatnot, parked the utility chair. I did some demo work here, some framing to get it all ready. This was pretty much the second day, what you're looking at here. Here I am on the second day. I came in and I started to hang the wall board. In this case, a huge hydro block, which is a really pretty good foam backer board for any type of walls in a wet area. Closed cell foam worked out amazing. Again, here's me installing the board. This is on the second day, making sure everything is nice and sealed up. Okay, what you're seeing here is about the, the fourth day. I didn't film on the third day. I came back in. I checked the balls. They were still a little bit, a little bit out more than I would like to really have it in industry standards or tolerances, you could say. So I screeded that back. Well, you could see there with the material, and I painted some hydro band on the sides, and I actually hit the drywall as well multiple times. So that way, I can do the coats of the hydro band liquid membrane there. So everything is basically ready for tile, as you see it here. Okay, here's installing the tile, the wall setting took about two days or so two full days this was day four and day five of the wall tile setting okay on this project i had to do some profiles and the entire perimeter of the uh, of the wall tile here the client did not want to go to the ceiling so that's what we did definitely took some time so i had multiple different angle miters to get all this to line up and look really good so I did that on day six and day seven. I cleaned up all the tiles set the days before and I also put in the shelves here with a special adhesive that actually go on the surface of the tile. But it came out really good and it held very well. So no chance of that ever, ever falling out, falling off. Okay, now this was the eighth day on site, the final day. I came back in, I did all the grouting, let it dry. Did the siliconing everywhere I could do and clean up the entire site. Pulled all the protection materials out of there, all my tools, loaded up the trailer, and so on. And that does take a lot of time. I have a 14-foot utility trailer, and there's a lot of tools required to do these projects, believe it or not. I get amazed sometimes still to this day after doing 25 years how many tools I need to do projects. It's crazy, but... Now you got a hundred grand in tools, a hundred grand in, in, in a truck, in, in a trailer. People wonder why things cost what they cost, but that's what they cost. Anyway, so I'm going to go over what this project took and how much a client paid me and my company to do this for them. So if you are watching so far, it took about eight days. Now there was a full, they weren't all full days. I'll, I'll tell you right now, I had one, two, three four half days and the rest were full days so not all eight hour days okay and then i had a total on this project of 50.25 hours again 50.25 total working on-site hours this is when i came to the job and when i left okay the total investment that the client made to do what i did here they supplied the tile the grout, the profiles, the shelves, I pretty much installed the install materials like the waterproofing, the wall board, the drywall stuff, the mortar, things like that, the protection for the floors and whatnot. So the total price to the client was 
$4,800. Once again, the total investment to the client, what they actually gave me, they paid me to do the project was $4,800. Again, I hope you enjoyed this video. If, I, if you have any questions at all about this project, put them in the comment section below. I do read most of the comments and reply to most of them. Thanks again for tuning in. Donnie D, signing off.